Okay, man. So now I want to talk about the issue of fixing your composition. I know that you can't necessarily do that right now, but I want you to pay attention to this one because this is where I want you to eventually get to. And when you have a little more flexibility and control over your environment, you're going to do this. Right now, I know you're at your um, vacation home and that's fine. However, on this video, I am going to change the, uh, from the, now we're, we're in landscape mode versus portrait mode. I am going to change it to portrait, mo portrait mode. I will show you this side view. You will see what it's like. You do not have to adjust your phone to view it, but we are now going to move over here. And I'm going to scroll it up. And this is sort of where you were, okay? You were, you had your eyes at the bottom third of the screen. So the bottom third is here. And where I want you to be, where I think you will look good, because you are a tall but wide fellow, um, you may look very good in the portrait mode, but I would recommend you doing it in landscape mode. I'm going to turn it back to landscape mode. Okay, there we are, landscape mode. Okay, so landscape mode um, still has you at the bottom third and the rule of thirds in framing in camera work is that if you divide the uh, place into uh, a, a, a three by three grid, so your space is now composed of nine frames, right? Um, then you want to put your eyes and your face on the upper third. Okay, now my eyes are actually right on. If I have a grid on, my grid on my camera shows that I'm on the top third of the frame. Here's, the, here's, here's my top third, here's my bottom third. And in movies and things, you'll often see that there is some, uh, there is space on one side or another. Sometimes you want to be dead center, and I have no problem with being dead center. But I also want you to find a nice composition, okay? So I can be here, and I'm actually on my third. Or I can be here and I can be in the middle, but there's activity and there's art artistry and there's some good shit going on here, okay? So here's my fix for that. Now, here's the next thing. You're wearing a white t-shirt. I get it, you're at your vacation home. I'm just telling you something to think about it, okay? You're wearing a white t-shirt and you had a white background. I actually have a dark background with this dark shirt. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to majestically change the color of my shirt. Hairy American troll. Ha ha. And one of my favorite colored shirts is this orange one, which makes me pop from the space. And now we're going to add the next component, which is this $70 lavalier microphone. And it gets plugged in. You can see it just gets clipped on further down than you think you need. Okay. It's, it gets clipped on down here. Okay. It's about, you know, I don't know, 14 inches from my mouth. And I'll put myself back up here, and I'm going to clip this in. And now we have different sound. Okay, so here I'm ready for delivery. There's the fix, or at least that's a pretty quick fix. I think you will look really majestic because you have a wide structure, and you're a tall fella. Um, when you set your stuff up this way, it will look really nice. Um, it's worth playing with the idea of portrait mode. But I don't know that that's necessary because I think that you may end up choosing some sort of 
cool architectural display background composition thing that offers some nice eye candy combined with authority in your field for whatever stuff you're looking at. Okay, the next thing that we're going to talk about is the subject matter and how to make it clear and straightforward in the next video.